I think everyone is just so excited to be back here. We had no idea what it was going to be like when we were going to come back, especially because of that hiatus. And knowing that the entire audience and the entire crowd loves us just as much as we love each other and love them, it just means the world to us to be able to put on a show for all of them. It's been familiar, it's been, of course, has its challenges, um, but overcoming those challenges has been really rewarding. It's such a great season watching all the pieces come together, and when we get here in Indy and we see them cake up the field and just light it on fire, it's just, it's just spectacular. It's what we're here for. The energy from the crowd as well and the audience has really brought that upon ourselves as well, especially when we're hearing the Vanguard yell for the first time in a long time, that really brought us all home. I think the fact that we maintained our staff was everything. Designers, I mean instructional staff, and I mean admin. So when we came back, it wasn't like we were starting at ground level. We just had a couple of pieces of rust to knock off the machine to get it rolling again. A lot of the answers were, if everyone else is in, I'm in. Because it's, it's not really about anything but the people that you're with and the team that we've built. We have a, like a three-year, five-year goal for what we want Vanguard to be, uh, not, not only for like scores-wise and success-wise, but also culture and tradition-wise. Every day that we've gone through this season, we've just been reviewing what we're doing and how to do it better next time. There are people in the world that love you. It's important that you let them love you and create pathways for them to love you. And that's really what our alumni do. Uh, and at this point, I keep telling the members, you know, every night, like this has been two years coming that I have been thinking about not much else other than bringing the core back for two years. Yeah.